But what are the most notable trends that we've seen so far this year is the real slowdown in the number of smaller transactions taking place. Now this it doesn't, isn't just impacting Australia, it's also something we've seen globally as well. Now this is a real canary in the coal mine for commercial real estate and is indicative of pressure points in the wider economy as well. Now due to the recent interest rate increases that we've seen in Australia, the cost of debt has gone up significantly for a lot of investors. Now the investors that are playing that smaller end of town tend to have more limited pools of capital they can turn to when debt becomes too prohibitively expensive. Now unfortunately what this means is if they can't seek alternative financing, they end up walking away from a lot of deals. Now this isn't something that we've just seen across one or two sectors, it's happening across all property sectors.